Thanks for watching Pix 11's Chiller Weekend. I'd really love to stay, but I gotta fly now because I'm going downtown to host the Village Parade. Bye. What did you think? I was gonna be flying this downtown? Uh-uh. Jeep was kind enough to supply me with this really cool ride. Now, if you're headed downtown, Jeep is gonna be there and they're handing out 20,000 glow sticks to help keep you safe and help light the way. Thanks for watching. Let's roll. Woohoo! See ya. Pix 11 presents the Village Halloween Parade. Good evening and welcome to the Village Halloween Parade. I'm Jill And I'm Tansa Vidal. We're making a little bit of TV history tonight, that's for sure. This is the first time the Village Parade will be live on broadcast TV. And Pix 11, so happy to be bringing it to you. And tonight is the night where all bets are off because there's so many amazing costumes that you're going to see. Lots of stuff that you never expected. All right, let's set the scene for you. We are in the middle, smack dab in the middle of 6th Avenue right now. The crowds are ready to go. Crowds. <laughs> We're between 8th and 9th streets right now. And of course, Craig's going to be stepping off in just a little bit. That's right. We have over a million people here tonight from marchers to floats to random people that are going to be walking you off the streets. It is going to be insane. That's right. And of course, the parade just stepped off from Spring Street a few blocks south of here. And that's where we find our own James Ford. He is in the center of it all. James, what are you tonight? Uh, right, we are here on 6th Avenue at Spring Street, the beginning of the parade. First, let me set this scene up here. Take a look over here on 6th Avenue. You can see the parade has begun. It has just started, and there are people lined up on the sidelines. But look, this thing's going to go on well into the evening. And so there's a lot of people waiting here, staging, getting ready to go into the route. And here are some of them. Take a look back here. Guys, who are you? There's the village people. Get it? And they've got all this MTA material. You got it. Y M. Where, where'd you come up with this idea, guys? Our great artist Andy Padre makes Metro Card costumes every year, so it just seemed right. It's the village parade. We're the village people. It's fun to ride on the Y M T A. We got a gift for you. Oh, that, oh, how nice. Yeah. How long did it take you to save up this many Metro cards? Couple weeks. Couple weeks. Couple weeks? Yeah. Uh, I've friends with the token booth clerk as well so he's helpful it, it looks great thanks for being here guys smile real big yeah we've got little red riding hood and the big bad wolf we got the avatars here we've got the teletubbies guys you're killing me here where are you from I'm from korea you came from south korea to be i love it to be at the west village from south korea to the west village how about some south korean love let's hear it yeah! Okay, that was really good. Look, this is just the beginning, and for every one of these guys, well, there's about yeah, 10,000 people. It's very well attended. We'll be here all night long. I think it's getting off to a great start. But right now, back to you up farther on 6th Avenue. All right, James, thank you so much. Let's talk about costumes. That's what this magical night is definitely all about. And, of course, you all, WPIX.com, actually picked Jill's outfit. This is what you uh, wanted to wear? Yes, you did. Good all job. Weekend long, we had Pix Chiller Theater. It was such a success. And by this morning, the votes were tallied up. Mm -hmm. And out of 15 costumes, we chose the sexy cop. So 10, what is it, 188 people, I think a it was? A lot of people. A lot of people chose this costume. What was costume. number two? Number two was the uh, gypsy, I believe. Ooh, and good. the party good choice. Cougar, it was so hard to choose, that's for sure. It was either one, but they're both hot costumes, right, I so think. So you're the police officer, so I decided to be the firefighter. You had to. Serve, right? Hand in hand. That's what we do it best, Hanson. We'll exactly. take care of the city, that's for sure. And of course, we'll be taking care of the parade as well. And our other reporters on scene tonight, Chris Glorioso and Deborah Alperone, they're here. And of course, they had to pick out their costumes too. That's right. But what happens when you send two really hard-nosed New York City <laughs> reporters out to pick out costumes? Well, they act like five-year-old kids again. Take a look. So we're here at Party City. We have got to find the best costumes Look at available. all of this. How are we going to pick? Well, we're going to be right on 6th Avenue. It's, it's going to be big Halloween great. parade. We're going to be co-hosting. Let's find the best costumes. Let's, Let's do go. it. Oh, yeah. I like it. <laughs> I think I should have my own talk show. I can't see you. Where are you? I'll have a blue 
Christmas, Christmas without you. Why the long face? Very nice. How about your favorite movie character? I think uh, I think I could do that. All right, favorite movie you, character. You don't like this. No. Okay. Oh, jeez. <laughs> it's me. It's me. Nice feet. Yeah, I think so. Deborah, I'm right here. Almost ready. Best costume ever. What? What? Gumby? Gumby? What if I pick something for you? Oh, God. You pick something for me. Okay. And that's I that. get to pick something for you. Whatever you want. You're on. Your situation is better than any situation I have ever seen. You're better than the situation situation. I think the situation has got a little situation going on right here. I like what you chose. I'm, a, I'm feeling a little Jersey Shore. Yeah, right but now. here's the thing. I mean, I appreciate Snooky, like... But seriously, I'm not a brunette. Look at this thing. Oh, come on, you make a great snooky. Wait a minute. I've got an idea. We still do the Jersey Shore thing, but with a twist. What do you think? Well, huh? first of all, you fill out that dress a lot better than I do, and I'm a man. What the heck? This is Jersey Shore. You're the situation. But your situation's more of a situation than my situation. I do have a situation, but this is the costume of the year. Jersey Shore, baby. I don't think it's going to work. I don't like being a brunette, remember? Oh, we forgot about the brunette problem. What are we gonna be? So I ultimately decided to be a zombie reporter. Rawr! And Deborah, what did you decide on? <laughs> What is this, a silver... It's a platinum. A, a platinum, platinum blonde. blonde. Yes. Like, this is the government. It certainly is a platinum blonde wig. I think it's looking good. You know, I was thinking... Like the bow? I do like the bow. I was hoping <laughs> that we could do the Snooky situation thing, but it didn't work out. I'm really out. glad we didn't, Chris. I'm really glad we didn't. <laughs> I thought I might bring a little fright to Fright Night. It sure did. I'm scared. And so I'm hoping to scare some of the people who actually come and walk down this 6th Avenue pathway a little bit later. Maybe show them what Halloween's really about. Well, I'm looking forward to seeing that and to having a Gaga off. So yeah. all you Gagas out there, come find me. Right I'm, here. I'm kind of Gaga for Gaga. As, as, well, you should be. But there is someone here that we need to talk to, right? Well, well actually, I want to show you a little something. When we come back to 6th Avenue, things are really going to heat up. I don't know. There's a, there's a lot of excitement on there. I want to know a little bit more about that, but uh, you'll find out what this gentleman is doing and where you can see him doing more of this just a little bit later. But for now, uh, you Tamsin know and Jill, we're going <laughs> to send it back hot, to hot, you. Hot, hot, hot. And thank you guys so much. Of course, we are excited to be here. And in the back, we can see a lot of that parade in the distance. Oh, yeah, course. that is Todd Robbins we're looking at right now, right? Oh, he is, and he's on fire. All right, guys, we're going to be right back. Don't go away. Pix 11's New York Village Halloween Parade is brought to you by Jeep and the unique brand of freedom you'll only find in the full line of Jeep vehicles. Visit Jeep.com for details. Peace, pride, victories. For nearly 70 years, we've had a lot to cheer about, and the celebration is just getting started. Introducing the 2011 Jeep Wrangler and the all-new 2011 Jeep Grand Cherokee, both with legendary Jeep 4x4 capability and Wrangler with a redesigned interior. Our entire line of Jeep vehicles is a definite cause for celebration. Now lease the all-new 2011 Jeep Grand Cherokee Laredo 4x4 for $3.99 a month for well-qualified lessees. One of the greatest gifts you can give is joy. And giving it to those less fortunate this year is simple. J.C. Penney and the Salvation Army have come together to fulfill Christmas wishes for tens of thousands of underprivileged kids and seniors. But we can't do it alone. Join us at jcp.com angel to choose your angel. 
will ship your gift to them for free. They need many things, but most importantly, they need you. All right, buddy. This one's going to be right where you like it. Here we go. Whoop. Sorry. Good eye. A little rusty. Oh, look out. Hey, Dad. Are we going to miss the game? We're good. Remote DVR manager. Set it from anywhere. I'm going to give you the deuce. So you don't miss a thing. Woo! At Time Warner Cable, we're moving technology forward. See? Just like your old man. Yeah, sort of. To bring you back together. Add DVR. Call 877-640-3995. This Monday, welcome to the Achievement Awards, where we honor the best and the brightest. And now, the coveted undies. That's right, the Underachievement Awards. Yeah, Who wants to celebrate underachievement? 90210. Tomorrow at 8 on the CW Pix 11. Welcome back. As you can see, we are watching the front of the parade approaching right now. It should be here any minute. We're definitely keeping an eye on who's out there. The clowns leading the way, as always. How exciting. Of course, we have a few surprises for you. But before that happens, we're going to go back to the starting line where our own James Ford is hanging out with a few interesting characters. James? And yes, here we are back at Spring Street and... Sixth Avenue. What you, you don't? What you don't like my outfit? What's going on here? Here, let me. Let me. I I try. I try. For you and for the Empire. Anyway, let's uh, finish setting the scene here. Take a look behind my friends here. You can see how some of the acts are lined up, getting ready to go on the parade. That's in the background. Now in the foreground, we've got all of our friends, including the Prince of Darkness, Satan. How are you? Very good. Having a great time in New York City. And why New York? Why Why did you feel you needed to be here? New York, New York. Nothing beats New York. Nothing. I love it. All right, and then I, I can't quite see you, but who who are you anyway? I am Robot, version 2.0. Uh, oh, okay. Uh, and he even has it on his driver's license. Okay, that's that's believable. Thank you, thank you. And then, whoa, how, how about you? What's going? Oh, wait, we, we kind of match, don't we? Uh, it kind of, it's like a theme. Thanks for coming out, guys. This is very believable. And you all are here as a group. Yeah. Great Thanks for coming out. This is just the beginning, and it continues from here, farther uptown. I can tell you, this parade is really getting underway right now, and uh, I'm a little cold. Back to you. I feel very safe with you around. That's all I can say. <laughs> yeah, we sure do. <laughs> all right. Well, the Village Halloween Parade, of course, is all about magic and it's about wackiness, but it's also dedicated to New Yorkers, about dedicated New Yorkers who take their time and put all their efforts into things like the artwork you're about to see. And of course, makes it one magical night. Deborah Alperone got a chance to actually visit what's considered the birthplace mm -hmm. of the parade. Deborah. I'll tell you, it's about two and a half hours outside of New York City, but I'll tell you, it's like right here in the village. These guys work so hard, hundreds of volunteers, and I want you to take a look at this beautiful place that I consider the birthplace of this parade. It's magical. It's absolutely magical. Quiet and serene and full of skeletons. Believe it or not, this magical place called Rokeby, a two-hour drive from New York City, could be called the birthplace of New York's Village Halloween Parade. These skeletons are celebrating life. That's why they're significant. That's why they lead the parade every year. And before they make it here, they're made here. Now meet the people who give their time. Enjoy your puppet, you know, be your puppet. If something happens to break, you know, I'm the person walking and fixing simultaneously and making sure that things are still performing because a 30-second break in theater is an eternity. It becomes part of your body. You're balancing, you're compensating for it, you're figuring out how it moves. You have to think about, like, your ancestors, and it makes you think of, like, people you want to remember who you've lost in that year. Some of them, you say, go this way, and they go, ooh, all over the place. Sorry? Like that? <laughs> like that, yes. They are a bit unwieldy because they're so tall. So any weight at all is going to start swinging about and pulling around. It's great company. 
It's a thoroughly enjoyable project and it's a beautiful place to be. I can't and for months, it. these people give their time. They take vacations, they take their holidays, and they go there up to Rokeby and they make these puppets. Puppets that you're going to see soon. I can't wait. And I'll tell you, it's cold out here, but I'm really excited about this. I'm going to send it on back to Jill and Tamsin. Are you guys cold too? We are very cold out here, but you know what? Yeah. It's a magical night, so we're going to keep it warm, that's for sure. We sure are. And look what's behind us right now. I actually see the Jeep. The Jeep is leading the parade right now, you can see for yourself. And I think we're going to be speaking to someone later yeah, from the Jeep itself. We sure are, actually. We've and got 15 people giving out glow sticks. Lots and lots of these glow sticks 20, right now. There's 20,000 of these. Unbelievable. And they're protecting us and keeping all of New York City keeping safe. Keeping all of us safe out there. Here we go. The Village Parade coming up on us right now. The Jeep leading the way. This is definitely a very exciting night. Now, for only the third time in the 38-year history of the parade, the organizers chose a really specific focus. Back in 2001, it was the city's rise from the 9-11 attacks. In 2004, it was the devastation in New Orleans from Hurricane Katrina. And of course, this year, it's the crisis in earthquake ravaged Haiti. Specifically, that's right, a part of the Haiti crisis often ignored the impact on the nation's culture and art. Uh, right now, we want to talk with uh, Jean Fleming, who's the parade's director. I think it was when um, Carnival was canceled that we um, realized that we had to do something for Haiti because the Halloween parade in a way is New York's Carnival. So we decided that what we would do is we would look for an artist. We would look for one artist who we could focus on and support so that at least we help one person in a really deep way. And the reason why we selected DDA Seville was because he had a purpose bigger than himself, and that was that he wanted to rebuild the art school in, in Jock Mel, which is the center of Haiti Carnival. And the reason he wants to do that is, is that so many of the great carnival artists, musicians, were all lost in the earthquake. Those people died. And so he knows that if there's no carnival last year, there's no carnival this year, that those traditions of knowing how to make those figures, listening to that music, all these children without parents, uh, whose parents were killed in the earthquake, that that soul of Haiti, the soul of Haiti, the carnival, the music, that was going to be lost. And of course, several bands and countless marchers are going to be on display all night long here behind us. You're going to see them all along the parade route, keeping the spirit of carnival and of course the culture of Haiti on display throughout the parade. We're definitely looking forward to seeing that all night long. All right, Tamson, switching gears just a bit here, Todd Robbins, you know who he is? Mm -hmm. Well, we just saw him a few moments ago with Chris Glorio, so now he's back on the street heating things up once again, and he's here to warm up the crowd. Chris, what's going on? Now, he is the star of and writer of a play called Aptly Play Dead. This is Todd Robbins, and I like your costume, Todd. I'm not, I'm not sure if it's a white suit with red blood on it or a red suit with ghostly white. I'm not sure. Well, it starts off white at the beginning of the show, and then it kind of ends up like this. How, how did this happen? I mean, uh, it seems yeah. pretty grisly. Yeah, Play Dead is basically, it's a 75-minute uh, ride to hell and back. Uh, it's, uh, it's got ghost stories on holy resurrection, and it's all designed to scare the shellac out of people. Uh, yes, well... I see you have some accelerant down here, and you know, we at PIX11, we really like the showmanship, so let's, uh, let's take a look. It's a hot night here, uh, so I thought I'd just kind of warm things up a little bit. We'll have some fun. Okay, I'm going to bring the micro microphone away from that, but here we go. Looks tasty. <laughs> Looks, oh, vanilla, he says. That one's vanilla. What about that one? That was chocolate. <laughs> Let's heat things up a little more, Chris, shall we? It's been nice knowing you. Cheers. <laughs> oh, whoa, 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 whoa. I'm getting out of here. I'm getting out of here. Whoa! What do you guys think about that? I guess that's one way to shave. I, I don't know if that would be my preferred method, but uh, 
Mr. Robbins, thank you very, very much. And so tell us a little bit more about the play, how we can see it. What's this all about? It's at the Players Theater. It's called Play Dead. We are in previews now. We open November 10th. It was written by myself and Teller of Penn and Teller, the quieter, uh, the silent half of Penn and Teller. And uh, it's uh, just fun for all ages uh, if you like things on the spooky side. Simple as that. Todd, thank you very, very much. Pleasure. I certainly like things on the spooky side. We all like things on the spooky side here at Pix11. So, Jill, Tamson, I want to send it back to you. I'm going to go find some more spooky people. Oh, I bet you're going to find plenty, Chris. Thank you so much, Todd. Thank you so much for being safe with those fires. Those were scary. Yeah, something that you <laughs> could put out, Miss Firefighter. I can take care of it. You have your Anytime fire extinguisher, you don't you? <laughs> Well, of course, we're going to be up in just a few more minutes. Right at the break, we'll get to see more of these performances and a lot more here at the Village Halloween Parade. Very Stay cool. tuned. Pix 11's New York Village Halloween Parade is brought to you by Clear. Clear is super fast. Take it with you, Internet. We're different because we're clear. <laughs> Introducing Clear. New super fast take it with you internet that makes New York one big hotspot. Check it out. All caps email from the boss. Critical changes needed to the presentation. Now! Clearly. In the taxi. So he won't miss his flight and spend all day on standby. Super Jeff does it again. Right now, you can get Clear at home and on the go for just $60 a month. Clear also lets Wendy do more, like plan a last-minute girl's getaway from home. Oops, I gotta go. And then book it before it's too late from the school parking lot. Nice. Clear is 4G, way faster than the internet you get on your cell phone. Go online or call right now to talk to a Clear expert and get internet at home and on the go for just $60 a month. Clear. Super fast, take it with you, Internet. Hey, did you hear the one about the people that drove two hours out of their way to go to a casino when they could have gone to Empire City Casino at Yonkers Raceway, which is basically right next door? Uh, neither did I. Hey, judge a book by looking at the cover. <laughs> With 72 cubic feet of cargo space, the CRV is built to surprise. Soldier Field. Motor Trend's favorite crossover, the CRV from Honda. Good news, sir. I just got an email from the office, and word is people really love our claim service, especially the Auto Repair Express. Repairs are fast and are guaranteed for as long as you own your car. Hey, that's great. Is this your phone? Yeah, of course. But where do you put... I, I mean, how do you carry... Here you go. Thanks. No, no, I got it, sir. GEICO. 15 minutes could save you 15% or more on car insurance. I am an actual vampire hunter. And with New York Lottery offering this Money for Life instant game, they've essentially sprung a trap for me. You see that guy? Here we go. This is how we do it. Die. What are you? Money for Life Die. on the New York Lottery. You can win up to $100,000 a year for life. And of course, a welcome back right now. Exciting. Pix 11. You know we're watching the village. Parade. And of course, Halloween Parade, not too far away right now, nope, we just right down the street. The yeah, we're seeing it in the distance. They are coming our way. A magical night. A little chilly out here, but that's okay. It's a good time for everybody. And now we have the Flying Karamatsu Brothers. They are ready to perform. Take it away.
the parade not too far away. It stepped off from Spring Street. It's going to be making its way right by us in just a little bit. But this is an amazing performance. Unbelievable, right? He lost one. He picked it right back up. It was good. They're really good. It's exciting. <laughs> and it's freezing. I, I got to tell you, it's really cold out here, so I don't even know how they're holding those things with their hands I know. Our right hands now. are frozen right here. We're trying to hold on to our toe warmers. But, uh. Very, very amazing show. Good time for all. We've got a great crowd out here. Lots of people dressed up wacky, we wacky costumes. Amazing costumes. And Lots of Lady Gaga making that happen. And there's, of course, over a million people going to be here in attendance and part of this parade from the marchers to the folks and to the acts. And, of course, we have all here throughout the evening. Now, there's some of our spectators. They're not too dressed up right now, but that's okay. I saw some glow sticks. <laughs> I saw they some of the glow sticks glow already. Stick. That's right. Jeep is providing over 20,000 glow sticks to keep us all safe. Very All right, cool. of course, one of the musical highlights of the parade tonight is sure to be the zombies doing their famous version mm -hmm. of Thriller. And uh, speaking of Thriller, well, they gave me a few lessons last week. Wow. And uh, later on in the show, I may actually jump in and join them. Take a look. <laughs> It's known as the most popular music video of all time. Since so last Halloween, the Pix crew tried our own rendition of Thriller, but as you can see, it needed plenty of work. This year, I figured I'd learn the right moves from the experts. I packed my dancing shoes and headed to Steppin' Out Studios in the city to get down with the zombie event planners. They're going to have me try to learn this, too. <laughs> they will be performing Michael's Thriller Dance at tonight's Village Halloween Parade. We have 100 zombies that registered, and we're going to be doing the Thriller Dance from Spring Street and 6th Ave all the way up to 17th Street. So we'll probably be doing it about 25 to 30 times. So you're just going to keep going and going and going and going. going, going. going. Yep. And what about makeup? <laughs> We're actually having a makeup lesson um, today after practice. Someone's coming in for about a half hour or so. We're going to really try to get into the mood and get into the zombie spirit. Learning the steps sure wasn't easy. One, two, three, four. But after doing it several times, I think I'm now ready to thrill the crowd at the parade. Look at those moves. Well, thanks so much, Samson. <laughs> I'm working it. And maybe later I will jump in and join and try to do the Thriller Dance live on TV. What do you think? Can't wait to see it. All right, this is exciting. The parade is almost here. There you go. You're looking at it. We're going to be right back. Pix 11's New York Village Halloween Parade is brought to you by Raymore and Flanagan, furnishing your style. Everything's on sale during Raymore and Flanagan's Countdown to the Holidays. Everything's on sale. Everything. Be ready for guests with markdowns on bedrooms, full, queen, king-size bedroom sets, brands like Bernhardt, Bellinesque, even youth bedrooms on sale. I'm redoing my bedroom. No money down, no interest till 2015, delivered in three days or less. It's going on now. Everything's on sale at Raymore and Flanagan. Hello? Kelly Regis, is TD Bank open this early? Of course. Hello? Kelly Regis. Does TD Bank have good rates on mortgages? Yes. Hello? Kelly Regis, can I get a TD credit card? Yes. Kelly, Kelly, Kelly. Regis, if I were to check my balance. Regis, when I said TD Bank has live 24-7 customer service, I didn't mean me. Oh. Hey, does uh, mustard go bad? Everything you want from the only bank you need. TD Bank, America's most convenient bank. An event so big, we couldn't keep it all inside. Nissan's National Tent Event. Get quality, versatility, and capability. See the stripes, get the savings. Now, lease row, just $1.99 per month. Or Ultima, also just $1.99. Event ends November 1st. Visit ChooseNissan.com or see your tri-state Nissan dealer today. All right, buddy. This one's going to be right where you like it. Here we go. Whoop. Sorry. Good eye. A little rusty. Oh, look out. Hey, Dad. Are we going to miss the game? We're good. Remote DVR manager. Set it from anywhere. Going to give you the deuce. So you don't miss a thing. Woo! At Time Warner Cable, we're moving technology forward. See? Just like your old man. Yeah, sort of. To bring you back together. 
at DVR. Call 877-640-3995. All right, welcome back to PIX11. You're looking at live pictures, of course, of the Village Halloween Parade. This is exciting. The parade is upon us. It is here. A magical it sure night. Is. We just saw the flying Karamazza brothers. Yep. And there's plenty more acts, over 94 acts, I believe, for it's the whole parade. Unbelievable. Can't wait. And we've got the clowns coming this way as well. But first, let's check in with our James Ford, who is live in the middle of it all. James. James, I must say, you're looking good out there. <laughs> Oh, thank you so kindly. Uh, that's very, very kind of you. Let's take a look at the various groups that are getting ready to... Why do you keep laughing? I, I kind of like this outfit. Let's take a look at the... Let's look at the various groups that are waiting to get on board this parade. Take a look over here. Yeah, they are wild. Look, this is a dancing society, as you can clearly tell. And you know what? Why not? I'm going to join them for a second here. Let's see how I do James Ford dancing. That's what you have when you <laughs> send a hard-nosed New York City that street reporter great. out there. He gets a costume on, and he's dancing. Ooh, I love to see it. Look at this. Now, I don't know how he's out there with no shirt on. Take a look uh, at that guy. Amazing. Wow. These are be some of these costumes absolutely beautiful out here. Well, folks, you and know what? I'll tell you. The parade is here upon us. It's, it's sure behind is. us. It has officially started. Here we go. And you know what's really cool? What happens? The downtown clown review, they walk mm -hmm. around the whole entire time during the parade. And what they do is actually, of course, collect money for the parade and to raise money for Haiti. Yep. And right now, we're, we're looking at the blessing band right now. This is uh, Mama Donna is out here with her glorious blessing band leading the world famous Greenwich Village Halloween Parade with blessings. That's what's going on right now. Yeah. They'll be walking ahead of the parade for the entire route and they're blessing. Beautiful. Beautiful. As they go, they're all dressed up, as you can see, in white and silver to emphasize the purity of their intentions. Yeah, maybe we'll be able to get an interview with Mama Donna. We're looking for her right now. The blessings will be with a smudge or holy smoke. That's what happens, as well as bells, bubbles, glitter, and spirit chanting. They will be sharing the blessings of peace and the blessings of goodwill, blessings of community. And I'll tell you what, this is what the Village Halloween Parade is really all about, is about a sense of community. And you can feel it as you as you, as you watch them come by and the people come out. Absolutely. Blessings of love, blessings of protection. And again, that's all happening here live. On Avenue. Absolutely beautiful. They're all in white and silver out here. Let's take a listen. This is live. This is the uh, blessing band. That's what you're looking at uh, right now. And of course, with a whole lot more right ahead because we're looking yeah. down the street. What do we have going on down there? I see a lot of puppets actually making their way down. And again, a lot more of this to come in just a few minutes. Pix 11's New York Village Halloween Parade is brought to you by Jeep and the unique brand of freedom you'll only find in the full line of Jeep vehicles. Visit Jeep.com for details. Peace, pride, victories. 
For nearly 70 years, we've had a lot to cheer about, and the celebration is just getting started. Introducing the 2011 Jeep Wrangler and the all-new 2011 Jeep Grand Cherokee, both with legendary Jeep 4x4 capability and Wrangler with a redesigned interior. Our entire line of Jeep vehicles is a definite cause for celebration. Now lease the all-new 2011 Jeep Grand Cherokee Laredo 4x4 for $3.99 a month for well-qualified lessees. This is a strawberry Pop-Tart, but this is a warm, fresh-baked strawberry toaster strudel. See the difference? Pillsbury Toaster Strudel, the one kids want to eat. There's nothing we love more than listening to our There's favorite song. love more than listening to our favorite song. But our favorite thing is eating Totino's Pizza Rolls. But our favorite thing is eating Totino's Pizza Rolls. <laughs> It's fall, so you know what to do, right? Break the rake. Fall is the best time to feed your lawn. And leaves are good food, rich organic nutrition. So mulch those leaves right in. Then use Scott's Winter Guard. It provides a fall feeding while helping those mulch leaves break down faster for an extra nutritional boost and a stronger, thicker lawn next spring. You got it! So break the rake, mulch leaves, and use Scott's Winter Guard. Save $5 at scotts.com. Waiting for this Monday's Gossip Girl could be uncomfortable. We can do this. No sex. Every nerve ending in my body is electrified. There is a no fire sex. burning inside me, ready to explode. When it finally comes, it's gonna be huge. Sex. Gossip Girl. Tomorrow at 9 on the CW, Pix 11. All right, welcome back to the 38th annual New York Village Halloween Parade. So Exciting night. Part of this. Yeah, First it's time wonderful. For picks, yeah. All right, we're going to check out what Deborah Alfaron is doing because she has a very special guest and someone that's very near and dear to my heart for a very long time when I was growing up, Deborah. Every girl's dream to be what this woman is. I thought it was Gaga, but I'm seriously thinking that I have the wrong outfit. Can I even get in here to talk to you? No, well, Barbie loses its value when it leaves the box. Oh, you know, Barbie, you look great because I know Barbie, I mean, Barbie's what, more than 50 years old now, but what's your secret? Well, with modern day plastic surgery, anything's possible. You, you know, your wig looks a little bit like my wig here. You think Barbie was the predecessor to Gaga? I don't know. Barbie's all natural, though. <laughs> Another thing, it's a little chilly here tonight, but here you are. You're in like this Barbie outfit. How do you keep warm? Barbie's been in the same box for nine years. It's heating. Really? What else do you have in that box? That's a secret. <laughs> a secret from Barbie. Well, thank you very much, Barbie. We do appreciate it. Can we get a little twirl on the box there? <laughs> People like Barbie still after all these years. Wait, where's where's your um, your big playhouse? Where is that located? That lives in the East Village with me. <laughs> okay, Barbie. We'll let you go. Thank you. Another 50 years to you. Thank you. Too. Hey, Debra, I want to know where Ken is, by the way. Where's Ken? Is he around? Maybe he's going to be making his way up the parade route shortly. Hey, that, that is day. not Ken. No. <laughs> that is not Ken, folks. Here's modern day Barbie. No Ken needed. <laughs> Single ladies. All right. Here Those we go. Puppets. We're looking at the puppets right now. Absolutely amazing. And of course, we're joined by a very special guest right now to ben talk about it all. Lily Saran with the Haitian community is going to be here with us now to speak about the Haitian community and the representation in the parade. Good evening. Good evening. Thanks for being here. Thanks for inviting me. Thank you. Lily, tell us a little bit about what we're looking at right now. Um, we have the puppets coming down the street, but let me talk to me about your involvement with the parade. Um, well, first of all, I'd like to say that we're thrilled that the parade has invited mm -hmm. Haitian artists to participate. I think uh, it's a show of solidarity with Haiti, the Haitian people, and particularly the artistic community in Haiti. Absolutely. And we are very, very pleased with that. We're, we really feel part of, we're part of New York, really, today, the Haitian community here. 
Yeah, um, the two um, puppets that are leading the parade, mm -hmm. created by DJ Civil, are um, representation of two of the Haitian spirits that uh, rule over um, the cemeteries. They are from the Gede family. Uh, it's Grand Brigitte and uh, Baron Samedi. And uh, they are celebrated on November 1st, which usually comes right after uh, the Halloween parade here. And some of us do go home to participate in the celebration. Yeah. Um, and it is wonderful today. Is that what we're looking at right now? Absolutely. Oh, we are thrilled. They're going to be coming up the street shortly. Yeah. We're very happy to see them. And uh, I think it's, it's really um, memorialized. Um, the silent souls that have right. passed on. All right. Thank you so much. They'll be coming up the street shortly, so we're going to check right back in with you and they pass our way. Lily, thank you so much thank for being you. with us right thank now. You. Let's take a look at the puppets that we've got going on right behind us. Actually, we've got Bond Street Theater Coalition Group, I believe, that's coming up right behind us at this point. Look at that founded in 1976. So this is cool. They use performing arts as humanitarian outreach here, and it's a tool for education and for healing in refugee camps, areas of conflict, and of course, post-war environments. And take a look at this amazing out here behind us. This is a Bond Street Theater Coalition. Again, they work in countries all over the world. Let's take a listen. Again, founded in 1976. Absolutely amazing. And again, we're here live at New York's Village Halloween Parade. This is in its 38th year right now. So much history involved in all of this. You know, this parade was named the greatest event on earth. Oh, here we go. Let's see what we're looking at right now. Spider monkey? It looks like that's what we're looking at. Uh, no, this is the snake, actually. Amazing. You know, so much time and energy, and there's uh, so much commitment that goes into this parade. That's the beautiful thing about it. And I was out here a little bit earlier today. I came down here around 1 o'clock and watched the, the you know, preparations that have been going on. They do preparations all year in advance to come out here and make this happen. And these puppets are absolutely amazing. They told us they were going to bring some of these puppets right up here behind us, and we're seeing them right now. Yep, uh, let's take a look. Right yep. behind so us. this is a snake, and, and see how many people it takes to really make all this happen. It's absolutely amazing. Look at those puppets. I love it. <laughs> all right, we're going to be talking about Haiti when we come back. We're going to take a quick break. Do not go away. We'll be right back, folks. PIX11's New York Village Halloween Parade is brought to you by JCPenney. New look, new day, who knew? One of the greatest gifts you can give is joy. And giving it to those less fortunate this year is simple. JCPenney and the Salvation Army have come together to fulfill Christmas wishes for tens of thousands of underprivileged kids and seniors. But we can't do it alone. Join us at jcp.com angel to choose your angel. We'll ship your gift to them for free. They need many things, but most importantly, they need you. Order by November 5th and get orchestra seats at the Radio City Christmas Spectacular for just $49.99 with no ticketing fees. Wow. Go to RadioCityChristmas.com and use code WOW49. Presented by Capital One Bank. My parents have always lived in Queens until two years ago when my dad transferred to Istanbul. They settled in quickly, found their local deli, a few shortcuts, and a neighborhood hangout. But there's one thing they miss. Their beloved New York Mets. So I asked City how many thank you points it would take to give them something special. Their old seats. Five and six, row C. City thank you points can be used for almost anything you choose. What's your story? City can help you write it. Look at you, kid. Steak, lobster, beautiful woman. How you doing? 
So, uh, you can eat that? Can't judge a book by looking at the cover. All right, buddy. This one's going to be right where you like it. Here we go. Whoop. Sorry. Good eye. A little rusty. Oh, look out. Hey, Dad. Are we going to miss the game? We're good. Remote DVR manager. Set it from anywhere. I'm going to give you the deuce. So you don't miss a thing. Woo! At Time Warner Cable, we're moving technology forward. See? Just like your old man. Yeah, sort of. To bring you back together. Add DVR. Call 877-640-3995. And welcome back to the Village Halloween Parade. Tamsin Vidal and myself joining you here live. And it's been an amazing evening so far. And of course, we have a lot of our reporters out there. Mm -hmm. And Chris Glorious, I believe we're going to check in with him. We have a zombie reporter out there tonight in place Look of Chris, actually. Him. Kind of just <laughs> wandering around. <laughs> I want to introduce you to my newest friend here on 6th Avenue. His name is Whoopi. I imagine sometimes you're in a very uncomfortable situation. Oh, of course, of course. You know, sometimes you just got to let it go and you can't help it. Whoopi, you sometimes have some sound effects. I'd like you to share with us one of those sound effects right now. This is for thousands, if not millions, of people out there. Okay, now one more time, and now I really, oh, oh, pardon, excuse us here, hang on a second, we seem to be caught in a, in a, a tangle of puppets here, so I'm going to send it back to you, Jill and Tamsin, so that we can get out of, uh, oh boy, this is pretty scary, wow. All right, we are actually looking at a Memento Mori right now, and of course, Lily has been with us uh, this evening. Lily, tell me a little bit about what we're looking at right now with Memento Mori and what it's all about, the official parade puppets. Well, um, what I know is that it says, remember that we all die, mm -hmm. and uh, of course, um, the Gede appearance at the parade also is a reminder that uh, this human experience involves both life and death, and it does happen. And uh, but when you're gone, you're you're not forgotten Absolutely. once you're remembered. And I think um, that's uh, that's what uh, the skeletons are. Yeah, you know, there's, there's, us. there's two puppets leading the parade. Yeah. They're guardians of the cemeteries. Absolutely, Baron Samedi and. Uh, Grand Brigitte, who are at the crossroad of life and death, and stand at the cemetery, at the cemeteries, and are venerated and revered because right. they are very good spirits. They protect life, but they also are there to remind us that part of life is. Is, is dying. And you know what? Uh, this has been a tradition actually for about 20 years. It was 20 years ago the Day of the Dead Skeletons first took their place here at the head of the uh, the Village Halloween Parade and links New York's festival and all the souls to ritual traditions worldwide. Absolutely amazing puppets out here. I'll tell you what, the work that goes into these, these costumes and the puppetry, absolutely amazing. And that's, that's what you're looking at right now. Yeah, it's very cool. Those patient. are the guardians of the cemetery, the yeah. two puppets that lead the parade the Village Halloween Parade. Absolutely magnificent. They're making their way back here behind us right now. You can see them both. Here they go. Let's take a listen. It's carnival. They have amazing uh, artistic uh, puppetries such as this. He's only 37 years old and he was in residence as an artist residence with the Halloween Parade and created this magnificent representation of the Haitian spirits who are guarding uh, the cemeteries and guarding the Haitian souls. Absolutely amazing. So much that goes into this. Oh, wow. Well, how long I'm does it take? Do you know how long it takes to create these? I mean, this is just, it's unbelievable what we're looking at, how large, larger than life these are. I don't know exactly how long, but I know he was about, he was working with them for about three months or so, mm -hmm. and he had help in order to create this, but he does that every day. And unfortunately, I know he lost his um, workshop mm -hmm. during the earthquake. And, oh, he um, did. Upon his return, we'll try to revive it and at work uh, tell me a little bit about the band that we're talking about right, right now, the Jara Ra band. Yeah, Jara is a, a well-known band by me and my family because I go 
I go assist them perform in the park and elsewhere. It's a traditional band in Haiti called Rara, and it comes generally after Lent, but um, and but they are there to accompany those spirits during this parade. And of course, and we teach uh, for the heritage, uh, uh, Haitian heritage. And uh, also, Haley from Brooklyn, uh, DJ Rara has set up its own non-profit organization to promote traditional Haitian culture. Absolutely. They work with students uh, in some schools with kids to teach them um, how to play those instruments and harmonize and, I guess, that's continue, amazing. Well, tell me about the, the puppets we're looking at right here behind us right now, Lily, because we have some right here behind us. These are the... Um, Those are the zombie puppets. The I I, okay. Yeah. The yeah. hungry ghosts. The ghosts, yes, yes. But I have to tell you, in Haiti, we're not afraid of the dead. We're not afraid of ghosts either. Right. In fact, um, there's a common saying that says the dead are very much alive and they are a part of our lives. Absolutely. So, they're reminders of all that remains uh, vital and alive. Yeah, and they mm -hmm. and they do continue on being part of our life in the tradition, in the culture, in the Haitian culture. What does it make you, as part of the Haitian community, and seeing this? So it says it has to be very beautiful for you to see as the head of the uh, Makes Halloween me parade. So here. proud. Feel, yeah. I really feel like a true New Yorker. <laughs> oh, you definitely are. I'll tell you that. Yeah. All right, let's take a look at what. Lily, thanks so much for being with us. What are we looking at pleasure. right now? This uh, is no, so I believe. interesting. <laughs> <laughs> Dixie Light Band from New York City and Big Nas. Yep, this is Big Nas. We, we have big Nazo. aliens going on they back are. here. They really are. <laughs> an extraordinary <laughs> rendition cool. band. Lots Very of eyes cool on those costumes. Aliens. This is Extraordinary Rendition Man <laughs> making his way uh, up the parade route. Very cool. Let's take a listen to the extraordinary rendition band. The Halloween Parade would like to thank our sponsors and supporters. Jägermeister, Pix11, Jeep, The Village Voice, Webster Hall, the New York Barclay Hotel, Monster Energy Drink, WKTU Radio, Zipcar, Bullmore Lanes, the New York City Department of Cultural Affairs, NYC and Co. Foundation, Here Theater, Mayor Michael Bloomberg, New York City Police Department, the Rudin Foundation, the Manhattan Borough President Scott Stringer, Community Boards 2, 4, and 5, the Bleecker Area Merchants and Residents Association. an actual vampire hunter. I know, it's uh, pretty badass. Okay, vampires are immortal, i.e. they live forever. And with New York Lottery offering this Money for Life instant game, they've essentially sprung a trap for me. You see that guy right there? Here we go. This is how we do it. This is how we do it. Die, die, What are you die, doing? Die. Stop that. Play Money for Life from the New York Lottery, and you can win up to $100,000 a year for the rest of your life. You keep living, we'll keep paying. Is he still there? Yeah, yeah, he's still there. Does he look pissed? Introducing Clear, new super fast take it with you internet that makes New York one big hotspot. Check it out. All caps email from the box. Critical changes needed to the presentation. Now! Clear lets Jeff do more in more places. Like make changes to his boss's huge presentation file and send it off from the taxi. So he won't miss his flight and spend all day on standby. Super Jeff does it again. Right now, you can get Clear at home and on the go for just $60 a month. Clear also lets Wendy do more, like plan a last-minute girl's getaway from home. Oops, I gotta go. And then book it before it's too late from the school parking lot. Nice. Clear is 4G, way faster than the internet you get on your cell phone. 
Go online or call right now to talk to a clear expert and get internet at home and on the go for just $60 a month. Clear. Super fast, take it with you internet. It's the Toy Story Adventure everybody's buzzing about. Disney on Ice presents Disney Pixar's Toy Story 3. Join Buzz Lightyear, Woody, and the Toy Story gang in an action-packed show that takes thrills to infinity and beyond. You'll roar with laughter at this colossal, ginormous, fun-filled live Toy Story 3 event. Catch all the excitement when the toys take over your town. Tickets start at $20. Coming to the New York, New Jersey area November 9th through 28th. We are live back here on 6th Avenue, and I am here with the Shake Weights. Now, Mr. Shake Weight, can you tell me a little bit about what you have to offer the community out there that is looking to get in shape, looking to get fit? I have the answer. The answer is right here. I've been doing this for two weeks. Two weeks, look at this. And look at that, you like the situation. Two weeks, oh, I don't know that guy. Oh, yeah, that guy. Well, we're in New York. Let me ask you this. Do you think they could make a shake microphone? Like, you know, so that I could get into shape like that? I mean, look, they got a mirror on this one. If they could put a mirror on it, they could probably stick a mic in there for you. I, and, and I wouldn't get to look at myself, you know. And see how you're speaking. Now, working out and doing your job at the same time. Shake weight, take it away for us. Let me see your, your best workout. Here we go. I want to throw it to my colleague, Deborah Alperone, a.k.a. Lady Gaga. Hi, Chris. Chris? I, oh, actually, you're not going to be that jealous, but other people might be that jealous. Look at who I have with me. Look, hand down, Anthony Mazza. Hand down at this. And come right on back up. Yes, I'm a very lucky lady here tonight. You guys are Spartans. Yeah, undergear Spartans. Undergear? Oh, and are you keeping warm? Uh, trying to. Uh, you guys kind of look like you could be some good Lady Gaga backup dancers. Yeah, we could. We could do a little bit of moves. Yeah, you yeah. think so? Okay, yeah, well, I think we could do something right you here. You think so? Yeah. What about you? <laughs> it's it's nice. We are under gear. <laughs> We're under it's gear nice. gladiators. Yes, okay, you stick with that story. How about you? We represent the under gear gladiators, the place to go for men's underwears and clothes. Okay, but you guys are only really wearing underwear. Like, that's it. You yeah. do know this, right? We do. Yeah, no, I, you know what? I know, I know this too. <laughs> it's clothes. It's still clothes. Underwear okay. clothes. There, yeah, underwear are clothes. Okay, so Lady Gaga, here I am. What's your favorite song of mine? Ooh, I say, uh, Love Stick. Love Games. Love Games. I don't even know that one. And you? Alejandro. Alejandro. Okay, can we get a little Alejandro here? Come on, help me! Alejandro! That's all I have to say. And oh, I, you know, I, you know, I, I love it. dress as a cop and a right? firefighter. I'll but, tell uh, you what. Now listen, underwear. if you can't be out there, if you can't be out here, it's okay. WPIX.com, that is where we're streaming the parade live as well. So you can watch it on television. But you know what's very cool? We have in front of us a computer from Clear. Clear is a super fast, take it with you internet that we're working with tonight. So we're able to watch our live stream at the same time. And it's very cool. And helping you learn the thriller dance that I will be performing in just a few minutes <laughs> live here. Yeah, down there on the street. I love it. Meanwhile, if you're out here, you're somewhere else trick-or-treating on this Halloween. By the way, happy Halloween. Uh, be sure and send us your pictures. You can send them over to WPIX.com. We're uploading them as quickly as we can. Thanks to Clear, making it all happen. We're going to have them on the website tonight. We're going to try to have them all morning long as well. I think tomorrow morning. We're going to have a long night tonight and a fun morning tomorrow. Sure, we are getting up at 3 in the morning. Again, the 38th annual Bill Tall Week Parade. We're live here throughout the evening, so make sure you stay tuned here on Pixel 11. And after the break, Jill's going to be dancing, so don't go away. Maybe. PIX11's New York Village Halloween Parade is brought to you by Jeep and the unique brand of freedom you'll only find in the full line of Jeep vehicles. Visit Jeep.com for details. Peace, pride, victories. For nearly 70 years, we've had a lot to cheer about, and the celebration is just getting started. Introducing the 2011 Jeep Wrangler and the all-new 2011 Jeep Grand Cherokee, both with legendary Jeep 4x4 capability and Wrangler with a redesigned interior. Our entire line of Jeep vehicles is a definite cause for celebration. 
Now, lease the 2010 Jeep Liberty Sport for $249 a month for well-qualified returning Chrysler lessees. Empty nest, new kitchen, new us. Who are we? Chic, modern, daring dinner party hosts. Well, that sounds dangerous. Maybe we're more the traditional Sunday brunch set. I'll expect slippers and a cocktail to be ready when I get home from work. Point taken. How about peaceful, quiet, cottage in the country folk? Now that's us. Spend over $2,500 on a new kitchen and save 40% on custom countertops until November 28th at IKEA, the life improvement store. All right, buddy. This one's going to be right where you like it. Here we go. Whoop! Sorry. Good eye. A little rusty. Oh, look out! Hey, Dad! Are we going to miss the game? We're good. Remote DVR manager. Set it from anywhere. I'm going to give you the deuce. So you don't miss a thing. Woo! At Time Warner Cable, we're moving technology forward. See? Just like your old man. Yeah, sort of. To bring you back together. Add DVR. Call 877-640-3995. Thinking it. Forget lethal injection, they could body wax this guy to death. They're saying it. You don't like the rules? Don't follow. And saying it. Why are you running away? Why are you driving away? And saying it. Distort, defame, and blaspheme everything we could get our hands on. Menti, Howard, Mocker, Lionel, only on Pix11 News. I was just about to say that. Introducing Clear, new super fast take it with you internet that makes New York one big hotspot. Check it out. All caps email from the boss. Critical changes needed to the presentation. Right, we are back live at the Halloween parade in the village, making its way up 6th Avenue right now. And around Jill Nicolini is taking part in none other than the gorilla. Gotta do it.
take it away. Jill, Alberta. you rock, girlfriend. You rock Thriller NYC. It's seventh year of production. And you know what? The zombies you're looking at range and age from.